and you joyful victorious company ready to take on the world young Igbo swearing was wow it was a great program it was very impactful i must say it was impactful it was car packed right from the beginning of the program to the end it was really awesome like i was really blessed i was touched i was transformed it was more than we expected i really enjoyed the program Lesson for me. It's impactful. It was educative. I learned a lot from today's message that our uh, GS preached. The excellent show. They talked about the dignity of champions that shows that we can make it without cutting corners as long as God is our focus. I really learned a lot. Uh, my the, the eyes of my understanding was really really enlightened. I learned a lot that we should not live in discouragement. We should not live in the last but we should wait on God. Now, waiting on God is not by closing our eyes and sitting idle. But we should wait on God by praying and developing ourselves in the every as well. Acronym of weights, which says, What am I today? You should ask yourself that question each and every day. And every day. And I held on to during the course of this program was waiting on God. I learned that we should wait on God as He has said in His word that they that wait upon the Lord, that He will renew their strength and they will mount up with wings like an eagle and they will run and they will not be weary. There are days in our life where we will fall, we would, you know, we will be discouraged and all that. But one thing is to wait, wait on God. And while waiting, you should trust. And you should trust in God. While trusting, your strength is being renewed and you can soar like an eagle. While the pastor's message was going on, there was something I was able to do. He said, no man that worries and sadness himself to the affairs of this world. And I also said to myself, I am success. I am successful. I have nothing to do with failure. All things are possible to me. I have nothing to do with impossibilities. And I know that with God on my side, everything is possible. One, one of the things I picked was when he said that if we know we want to soar, we can't just stay idle because you can't be what you want to be by saying I do. And there was something our GA said, our dad in the Lord, it said, if you target nothing, you achieve nothing. And that was struck me. So we must all have a plan. What I really picked from the point was that not limiting your deliverer. Like, I like that you don't limit God in any way. Like, in any situation, you don't limit God. So God can still do something in the life of people like this, like people that have gone deep in sin, that you think they can never return back. God touched his life and he was able to realize that, yes, I can be what I want to be and what God wants me to be. So it's really amazing. We are also told us to make success academically. We are blessed by the message, even the prayers, there was great testimonies. Right from the choir presentation to the activities, the, the uh, pastor message itself and the testimonies, well, it was it was great, it was very superb. God helped us in the program and we had great testimonies from people. I also learned about you know the, 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 the you know the principle of resisting the doubters. There are people that don't believe in your vision or that don't believe in your goal. You don't let that affect you. You stand your ground and when you do that, you will soar like an eagle that you are meant to be. And I was really blessed. And yeah, you dear, I'm encouraging you that you should welcome the Lord in your life and you should trust Him. You should have interest in Him and in your academic life, physical life, spiritual life, and your mental life. The Lord is going to bless you. And I'm praying for you that you also so high, even higher than an eagle. I've never seen soldiers like you. You will excel. You will succeed. And the spirit of the conqueror, the Lord will implant in your life.